Let's try it, uh, let's try it this way around. Okay, so, two parts by carbonate of soda, and three parts crypto fentanyl. And it turns yellow. Of course it turns yellow. Why does it turn yellow? I need it to turn red. Oh, why does it turn yellow? What am I doing wrong? Two parts of my company, so on a three parts. Oh, of course. Of course I miss out the first step. That's just... Wait, who's that? Wait, who is that? I've never seen her before. Wow, she looks really pretty. Uh, what is she? Is she a Lamia or? No, wait, is she? Oh, oh no. Oh no, she's coming in here. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not ready. Uh, I, I need to clear this stuff away. I, I, I don't, I don't have enough time to. Hey, hello. Um, welcome, welcome to the clinic. <laughs> My name's Dr. Mumro. Um, I'll be I'll be uh, assisting you today. Um, um, I don't think I've ever seen you here before. Oh, well, um, that's great. Glad you chose the Mumro Clinic as your uh, as your go-to doctor. <laughs> Would you like to sit down? Well, as I say, I don't think I've ever seen you here before. Um. You might need to fill out a, uh, a, a form. Oh, no, 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 relax. It's not, <laughs> it's not pages and pages, don't worry. It's just one small sheet. In fact, you know what? I'll, I'll fill it out for you. you. You just tell me the answers and I'll, uh, and I'll put it down. All right? All right. So, first question, nice and, nice and easy. Uh, what's your name? All right. And how do you spell that last part? Got it. Okay. Um, when was your last checkup? All right, I'll put that down. Good, good. Okay. Do you have any underlying health conditions I should know about? Whew, my God, the way that she speaks, her voice is... Oh my gosh, her voice is beautiful. Wait, what? I... I said something? No? No? I didn't, I, I didn't say anything. No? I don't think I did. Okay, I'll put that down too. All right. And final question, uh, what is your address so that I can send, you know, medication and stuff through the mail? All right, excellent. Well, let me be the first to welcome you to the Mumro Clinic. I look forward to having you. As a patient, <laughs> um, what seems to be the problem today? What what brings you to the clinic now? Just just a checkup. Oh, well, that's good. You're the first on my book today. Yeah, yeah. No, no other, uh, no other patients are booked in for today, except except a uh, troll who's coming in here um, just after midnight. Yeah. Dark creatures like that don't generally tend to like walking around in sunlight. Well, he needs to, you understand, because, uh, well, not to go too deep into troll anatomy, but trolls um, tend to have this side effect of turning to uh, stone when confronted by direct sunlight, so I need to make it a, a nighttime appointment. <laughs> but enough about uh, my other patients, confidentiality and everything. If you care to step in here, um, we'll begin. <laughs> okay. 
<clears throat> if you would um, care, care, care to uh, just raise yourself up so that I can see. There you go. All right. So, of course she's gorgeous. Of course she's gorgeous. Of course she has a gorgeous body. Why, why on earth would it be easy? Why on earth would this be easy? And... Mm -hmm. No, no, nothing's wrong. No, nothing's wrong. You're, uh, you're, you're perfect. Um, um, you're, you're, you're looking good. I mean, I mean, no, um, forgive me. Um, it's nice to meet a patient who's actually healthy. <laughs> it's nice to have someone healthy to talk to. All right. Do you put anything on, um, on your scales? Because... You, you have exceptionally smooth scales. Oh, no kidding. Well, well it, it, um, it certainly does uh, make you a lot more... Um, <clears throat> um, it certainly does make you a lot more uh, attractive. Uh, I, I mean, um, n n not attractive. Uh, well, not that I don't think you're attractive. It's just... It makes you look healthier, is what I meant to say. Come on, Lamaro, you need to be a lot more professional than this. I know she is gorgeous, but you need, she's a patient. She trusts you, come on. <clears throat> um, apart from your scales, um, does the skin up here uh, affect you at all? Well, uh, in this hot weather we've been we've been having lately uh, do you find you get burned easily with the sun all right that's fine then no no that's fine that's fine okay now uh let's check your hips make sure the joints <clears throat> are um are are in the right place I think that's good you got good mobility there Good, good. Excellent. Everything seems to be uh, moving the way it's supposed to. <laughs> That's good. Um, okay, I'm just bringing up to your uh, to your chest. Um, uh, this might be a little cold. <laughs> All right. Okay. No, no, nothing's wrong. It's it's just nice to listen to your heart. It's very fast. Are, are you all right? Well, normally your species does have a uh, fast heartbeat anyway, um, but it just seems a little quick is all. Did you, did you like exercise before you came here? Oh, I see. All right, that's fine. <laughs> sounds good it's a very strong heartbeat as quick as it is it's very strong okay I'm just gonna move around to your back uh, just check your breathing okay your your skin really is exceptionally smooth did, did do you are you sure you don't use anything well I'll be <laughs> how about that all right anyway Take a deep breath in. And another one. That's good. And one more. Good, good. All right. Your lungs and heart are perfectly normal. <laughs> All right. That's just the final check. Let's just do a uh, mouth check. Make sure your tonsils are okay and your tongue. Okay, if you could just open your mouth for me. Say, ah. Uh. Whoa, that, that, is, uh, that is a lot of teeth. <laughs> Whoa, I don't want to think about what would happen if uh, your mouth came down on my hand. 
<laughs> you wouldn't do that, right? All right, good. Mm, good to know. She has a very large mouth. I could almost fit my entire arm in here. Hmm? No, no, I didn't say anything. Your teeth are exceptional. Well, you know, I, I, I mean that in the most professional sense, of course. You, you know, creatures of your species often, you know, don't care about what they bite, and they can chip their teeth and all that unpleasant stuff. But you seem to have taken pretty good care of your teeth. It's good to know. Okay. Um, if you could just, uh, extend your tongue as far as it'll go. Whoa. Um, that, that, that is a, that is a long tongue. Ha, 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 hmm. Um, no, 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 nothing's wrong at all. At all. Uh, I, I just didn't expect your tongue to be that long. Um, hmm. I, no, no, it's fine. Uh, just give me a moment. Uh, I just need to take the temperature of your tongue. Uh, this is a really good way of, uh, checking for your temperature. <laughs> if I just grip the end and just, I'm just going to pull very, very lightly so that, you know, it is extended the furthest it can be. All right. All right. Just tell me when. Okay, about there. That is very long. <laughs> Whew. Um, all right, uh, just give me get the thermometer. There. Okay. Just have to hold it there for five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Okay, there you go. Okay, let's see what we got here. So that's 37, 37. Let me see, 37 is, 37 is perfectly normal. <laughs> well, ma'am, you are all done? Yeah, it was pretty quick, right? Um, well, just for the checkup is, uh, <laughs> don't worry about it. It's, it's when we start getting into the, you know, heavy medicines and things like that. No, oh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I, uh, well, that's very kind of you. Thank you. Honestly, I don't tend to charge patients when nothing is, you know, used. Um, I mean, I guess I could charge you for the thermometer, but no, don't worry about it. It's fine. That is exceptionally kind of you. Um, listen, at risk of sounding totally inappropriate and totally, totally out of line. Um, I know this breaks patient doctor confidentiality a little bit. Would you, um, would, 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 would you, uh, maybe consider, I mean, would you maybe think, uh, would you let me take you to dinner? Wait, really? No, no, I, I, yeah, yeah, sure. I, I just, I don't know, I, I just thought you'd say no. <laughs> oh, you're, you really are too kind. I, I don't know what to say. All right, uh, well, if you're not busy later on, um, like I said, I've got the troll patient coming in just after midnight, so... For the rest of the day, I'm pretty free. Uh, how about I pick you up around eight? We'll go someplace nice. All right. It's a date. Uh, unless you don't want it to. I mean, if you don't want it to be a date, that's 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 fine. I don't mind. Oh, you do. You do want it to be a date. Uh, well, that's that's good news. Uh, it is completely my pleasure it's my job uh, I, honestly it's it's no trouble honestly the thermometer uh, uh, how about this how about you just buy me a drink and we'll call it even all 
All right. All right. Sounds good. I'll, uh, I'll see you around eight. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Just be careful of the step on your way out. <laughs> Careful of the step. Be careful of the step. You couldn't have thought of something a little cooler than that, like see around or oh, no. Mind the step. That, that was your big close. Good job, Mamuro. Good job. Oh, she was gorgeous. <laughs>